robotic critter. Uh, so you basically, there's an app that runs on the phone that's like the little automated personality. In this case, we have two personalities. One is named Ike and the other one's named Lucy. Mm -hmm. And uh, you guys both want to get in the picture? I'll take a good picture. We'll launch uh, the app. And then the phone's going to stand up here so I don't get startled. <laughs> okay. And um, right. so uh, once it stands up, then uh, I can interact with it. And it uses face detection in the phone so it sees me. And if I get too close, it freaks out and it tries to back up. And then if I get far away, it loves me and then you can, it tracks my face using face tracking. You can see it's like its gaze is changing. The lighting in here is a little funky. And then after it's, oh, that's too close. And then after it's played with me for a little while on the, um, on the uh, face tracking, eventually it'll ask for one of its toys. Let's see if we can get it to get to that point. Come on, buddy. Let's see, I'm, I'm moving my head back and forth to make the gaze change. I can, I can, you know, diddle with his eyes. Mm -hmm. um, I have another version of the app where I can poke him in the eye and he'll get mad. <laughs> it's kind of fun. And then um, eventually it'll last for one of its toys to see if it does that. And is it going to do it? Maybe not. But um, anyway, so that's what it is. And then um, it has an it has a really advanced vision library that's in it that basically uses for tracking faces and toys. So you can see here, like here we are in the hallway, and you get, there's you filming. <laughs> and uh, I can hold up the blue toy, and you can see like it draws a box around it. And all this is running. The lighting in here is kind of funky. All this is running on the phone. Oh, there we go. So it's doing vision tracking on the phone. So. Uh, also, this robot runs um, ROS from Willow Garage, mm -hmm. so we have a ROS node that we've built for it, so we can take advantage of some of the really advanced uh, things that, uh, that ROS offers. And the ultimate is, if you want this robot, you can get it. We're running a Kickstarter for it right now, and uh, if you go to www.kickstarter.com and do a search for Oddworks, that's O-D-D-W-E-R-X.com. And for 99 bucks, you can turn your smartphone into an autonomous robotic critter. Cool. Thank you. You're welcome.